Hello and welcome to Disc Golfing 101. In this episode, we will be discussing nine key techniques every disc golfer should know. It may seem simple, but the key to excellence in disc golf is mastering the basics. So let's get started. We begin with the standard drive. Keeping the disc parallel to the ground at all times, start with a 90 degree wind up, pivot foot, plant, and follow through with the hips. The next technique every golfer should know is the forehand. In certain situations, it is necessary for the disc's fade to curve in the opposite direction of the more common backhand. Building off the basics we have previously discussed, begin with a pivot, plant, and follow through with the throwing arm. The only difference being the wrist snap is inverted with the palm facing upwards. From the hips up, the standard putt closely resembles the standard drive, but from the hips down, it is a whole new ball game. Take your cowboy stance and keep your feet firmly planted on the ground throughout windup, rising up to your toes only at the moment of release. Moving on to intermediate techniques, we will be breaking down the tomahawk. Keeping the disc perpendicular to the ground at all times, the player must begin with a 90 degree turn towards the direction of the flight path, followed by a large scissor step forward with the dominant foot coinciding with the wind up. This should emulate a hawk preparing for flight, as opposed to the common misconception of comparing the technique to early Native American weaponry. The turbo putt utilizes a unique grip with the thumb supporting the bottom of the disc with the palm always facing the chains. Remember to counteract the motion of the throwing arm with your free arm. Once you have mastered the intermediate techniques, you are ready to move up to the advanced skills. The Power Drive, also known as the 1080 Salute, has three total revolutions, which we will break down into three simple steps. Begin with a standard chip on the shoulder 360, followed by a hallelujah, and the ever-challenging sidekick fakie. Upon release, allow the entire body to follow through. To execute the over-the-head backhand pitch, begin with a wind-up, bunny hop, and release. Remember to utilize the Neanderthal shuffle to avoid unnecessary back strain. The key to the crow's foot is the unique grip. Begin by wrapping the middle finger around the index finger and the ring finger around the middle finger. Now you are ready for a superior forehand. Perhaps the most challenging skill in all of disc golf to master is the flailing desperado. Launch from the non-dominant leg into a B-attack twist, followed by a fly swat directly into a Mr. Miyagi. Right hand rodeo, a 180 stair step, a final rodeo into a Charlie Brown and follow through. Remember, it takes years of practice to master these advanced techniques, so don't get discouraged. Practice makes perfect. Thank you for watching this episode of Disc Golfing 101. And oh yeah, hydration is key. Well, that's all the time we have for today. I'm Justin Case saying, see you later. With my gator. <laughs> and Viking, and Valkyrie, and Monster, and uh, <laughs> yeah, well, you get the joke. <laughs>